Hi, thanks for joining me. And in this tutorial, we're going to talk about the recent addition that Google made to the new Google Sites, which is a tool that allows users to add buttons to their website. Now, this is a huge piece to me personally, but I think you guys are going to like it too. Um, whenever you're making a website, it's great to be able to put text on a page and then be able to link to it. But if you can give your users a button to use when they're clicking, it just kind of changes the whole look and feel of your website. So I'm going to show you how to do that really quickly, just a couple of different ways. First of all, if you want to add a button to your site, the button tool is on the lower right hand side of the insert menu. And if you want a button, you just click and then give your button a name and then provide a link. So if I wanted to, I could uh, type in a web address here and then click insert. And so here I have a button that I can resize and then move it wherever I would like. So, and of course, whenever you move a button or any element on your page underneath a text box, then your element takes the size of that text box, but I don't want it to be that large. So I'm gonna move it down here between these two sections and then I'll resize it. So that's one way, uh, just to create a button and add a URL to it. But a lot of people don't realize that whenever you add links to text on your Google site, you can actually choose not a website, but another page in your site. So I'm going to show you how to do that as well. So I'm going to click on button again. And in this case, I have a page that takes users to a playlist of my Google Drive tutorials. So I'm going to call this Google Drive Tutorials. And since this page already exists in this site, I can browse through this list of pages here. So I'll click on Google Drive and click Insert. And I have my button. And I'm going to drag it right up here. And of course, I do want that to be a little bit larger. So um, I'm going to place it just below it between these two sections as well. So um, easy ways to add buttons. You can make them a button pointing to a website or you can make them a button pointing to another page in your website. And if you want to see what those look like to the user, don't forget you can click the preview button at the top and see that and, and you can test out your button and see how it works. So quick and easy feature, but awesome feature at the same time. So hopefully you guys like it. Um, don't forget to visit my YouTube channel. And also visit me on the web at www.techiecoach.com. Thanks for joining me.